Okay, this is part two of this uh, light commutated lid motor. And I'm just using a plastic lid uh, with a needle that's suspended from strong magnets uh, as the rotor assembly and then these solar panels with the coils on it and then a magnet that I've moved from here to inside the rotor. Now, I got this design from watching um, a video on how to use a fidget spinner and make a fidget spinner into one of these uh, Mendocino type motors and also I did a lot of research online of the three panel uh, configuration instead of the four panel configuration and the key to these Mendocino motors which is what they call this is how they're wired up and it's a strange way it's done uh, you would think you could just put a coil on a panel and uh, it would work but they have to be connected all together for the commutation to happen otherwise it would just sit there but what's happening is the lights coming through the window it's a cloudy day here and it's hitting that array of panels and coils in such a way that it's energizing the coils to pull and push on that magnet that's underneath there and it does it in such a way that rotation happens and uh, this was uh, discovered long long ago but uh, it ended up being called the Mendocino motor but uh, anyway this is a uh, what I am at right now is uh, this three panel suspended by a needle now if I sh give this the juice here this gets real fast somebody asked me what happens when you when you speed it up watch what happens here This will start to go unstable. Sometimes it stabilizes out and it looks really, really, really cool. But eventually, this will go unstable and fall off the needle, off the magnet. The needle will um, fall down. But watch the f camera frame rate on this. It will actually appear to look like it's slowing down, almost stopping. And then go backwards as this thing revs up. I'll turn the light off and let it wind down. But uh, yeah, these things can spin up pretty darn fast, depending on how much light, you know, how much energy you give them. But uh, anyway, this was my little um, light commutated lid motor. Let's see if I can get it off here without breaking it. And uh, what it is is. Uh, it's just a lid with a needle in it and those coils are just stuck on with two-sided tape and some of that foam tape and it just hangs from the uh, from the strong magnet up there and then I was showing the magnet over here on the side but it's better if you have it running inside the rotor and uh, anyway that's where I'm at right now with this uh, light commutated lid motor thanks for watching